After a protracted tug of war between the ruling coalition and the opposition over the inclusion of Eldas Member of Parliament Aden Kainan in the Kenya Kwanza team for the bipartisan talks. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen of the press. President William Ruto led side has finally yielded to Azimio demands to have the long serving MP of the team for the talks to kick start. We appreciate the reconciliatory route taken by our Azimio counterparts to engage in talks and stand down the planned street demonstrations should Kenya Kwanza recuse elders member of parliament the honorable Adam Kainan. The ruling team says it had reached out to the coalition's top brass as well as Kainan over the matter and the legislator had willingly agreed to relinquish his seat in the team for the greater good. The honorable Adam Kainan has graciously agreed to recuse himself in the greater interest of this country and the exercise that is before the bipartisan committee. Na kufuatia kujiondoa kwa mwishimua Kainan, tumejadiliana pia na tukaweza kumteua mwishimua Dido Raso, mbae ni mbunge wa Saku, constituency of Marsabit County, ili ajaze pengo ambalo limeachwa na mwishimua Kainan. In a statement issued earlier by Azmio and which was signed by Waipa Party leader Kalonzo Musioka, the opposition side had stated that the coalition was ready to call off protests if only Kainan is replaced. And I want to tell you this should be the last condition. I know all the cuts. This should be the last cut. Please remember we have a country, a country that we require to jealously protect. In the interest of the nation, we always will bend backwards be able to move forward and that's why we are even on our because we are willing to bend backwards and we have it. I am going to consult my co-chair, the Honorable Motiel de Amolo, so that tomorrow we can agree on uh, how to make progress and that the country is actually brought out of the anxiety it is in. The Raila Odinga-led coalition has been holding protests over the high cost of living and alleged electoral fraud and had vowed to resume demonstrations on Thursday unless their demands are addressed. Having given in to their demands, the Kenya Kwanzaa team now wants their Azimio counterparts to remain true to their cause and ensure the talks do not collapse yet again. Philip Muruto, K24, from Parliament Buildings.